my locker is pretty much completely full. I really, really need to get myself some more storage. So hopefully in this episode, I'll be able to get that done. So yes, hello everyone, Fudgy here, and welcome back to another Unturned Life episode. I'm here in the shack. Pretty sure Ryan's home as well. Now I'm confused because, look at this. Oh, hey Ryan, did you just throw a flare? Oh, hello, uh, Yeah. Blue Beret. But the reason I'm confused is because there is an eviction notice here. It says, this building has been built illegally without Soprano approval. Cease your building immediately or your kneecaps are forfeit. I don't understand. I'm a Soprano myself. It's like they don't realize that I'm living here. So I'm very confused. Ryan, what's going to happen, man? I'm a Soprano myself. Surely we can get out of this, right? I don't understand why we can't have this shack. Oh, no, dude. What are you doing? Don't burn yourself. Who's that over there? Hey, uh, fellas. What's going on? Hey, what's up? Uh, Don't burn my uh, have you, uh, Have you been to the, the, the war zone over there? Have you seen how bad it is? Uh, with the outlaws? Uh, no, I have. I have. Uh, yeah, I have to. Yeah, it's pretty bad. Oh, it's Victor. Uh, it's Victor. <laughs> hey, man. I remember in last time. You okay? Yes, I need you to come with us. I have something for you. I need to speak with you in private. Oh, um, uh, time. sure, okay, but before we go, I'm glad you're here, because I want to ask you about this right here. Why have we got an eviction notice from the Sopranos when I'm a Soprano myself and I'm living here? What's going on? Well, you see, this here was put here because the, oh, the builder decided to build here without asking us first. Does that mean uh, I'm going to be homeless again? Vic no, Victor. we'll uh, we'll relocate you as soon as possible. Okay, yeah, yeah don't worry about it. I'll um, we'll, we'll sort it out. Yeah, anyway, yeah, let's well. let's go have this talk. Is is everything okay, by the way? Yes, I'm just in need of your help. Uh, okay, no worries. Oh, okay, I'll fellas, the Sopranos need me, so I'll see you guys later. All right. All right. Uh, oh, oh, Ryan, make some food, okay? For wh when we get back, we'll have uh, we'll have some some dinner. All right. Yeah, I'll see. Get, get some baguettes, uh, some cheese, all that good stuff. Thanks, man. All right, see you, Ryan. Right, I wonder what's happening today. Where are we going? Um, hopefully, it's not in that direction because, as you guys know, the outlaws are over there, and that would not be good. So basically, we have a cargo mission for you, Boris. We need you to use the train that I'm not sure if you know, but we own the train on this map. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you mentioned and, that at uh, one point. I need I need your help in delivering a very important, uh, let's call it item to one of our customers. So I will have you take the train, uh, drive it from this, uh, let's call it station, even though it isn't a station, All right, right here close to the old safe zone, down to Antec shipping in the south. You will have um, Oscar here come with you for protection and you will have Owen uh, at the delivery point with a boat he will take the the items you're delivering and give them to the our customers by by boat. Oh, dude! Okay. I hope you have a car, Jack. <laughs> Wait, what? You're still driving? Keep going. We can drive like this. What? This thing's crazy. All right, everyone out. Can't believe you just. Tipped it over. I'm not surprised to be fair. I mean, I've drove this vehicle before and it was tipping all over the place. Wait, ready? Hey, nice. Good. Oh, oh never mind. <laughs> no. No. Oh. Oh. Wait. There you go. Oh. Hey, I did it, fellas. So, I am going to be driving the train and taking some items. Wait, what am I taking, though? The future of. Berry dealing. The future basically. of berry dealing? So it's I'm, I'm going to be trans transporting berries, essentially. Not berries. Not uh, berries. Uh, okay. Uh, Can't you, like, take a helicopter or something? Or is the train just the best way of doing it? Oh, here it is. There's a lot of crates on the back as well. You see, helicopters have a limited uh, cargo space. Uh, I think ah, the train yeah, is very the true. way. Very and true. probably the fastest way to to get to point A to, from point A to point B given this is one of the fastest vehicles. So you said I need to travel uh, south, which is in this direction, right? So I'll be driving it backwards? That's correct. Correct. Uh, um, interesting. You will okay. be driving to Antax Shipping, if you check your map. Antax Shipping. Ah, here it is, right in the bottom left. 
So let's see. I think the tracks are here. Yeah. Oh, we've got to go through a tunnel. That'd be cool. Right. So I'm getting a walkie talkie and an earpiece so I can keep Victor up to date. Oh, if, yeah, actually. Yeah, you might as well keep that there if you didn't mean to drop it. I do need some more mags. Yes. Thanks, bro. Just in case. Uh, oh, a drum. Yeah, it's even better. Okay, so what frequency should I go on? Can never be too safe, right? 550.327. Okay, radio check. One, two. Can you hear me? Yep, read you loud and clear. Copy that. All right, we're good to go. What are you going to do now, Victor? Are you going to head back to the safe zone, or are you going to come with us? I'll uh, go back okay. to the garage. Uh, I have some stuff to attend to. Uh, once you pack, this is the meeting point, by the way. You're going back, uh, to Antact. You drop the cargo, and you come back here, and I'll be sure to reward you. Yeah. Ooh, sounds no good. All right. Well, so uh, wish us luck. Sounds uh, pretty straightforward. Back, right? Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll give you a shout once we uh, once we make it there, and then you can come pick us up, okay? All right, we've got one-way glass on the side as well, which is what I like to see. Goodbye, Victor. Full speed ahead or backwards. It looks so strange when the trains go like this, <laughs> but... You know, I, I think it's a little slower than it going forwards. Not by much, though. I think it's only, like, maybe 10 kilometers per hour, maybe 20. So it's not too big of a deal. But, yeah, we should get there in no time. Although, to be fair, it is the complete other side of the map. There's the uh, the old safe zone. Apparently, I, I think there might be more outlaws in there now. So we've got to stay way back from there. We can't go in that safe zone anymore. Oscar? Uh, Oscar? Did you see that? There's a barricade. Did no one scare out the tracks before we did this mission? W what do we do? I think we need to get out. Okay. Oh, we got a helicopter. Um, okay, I'm worried that this is something to do with the outlaws. Does anyone know about this, by the way, Oscar? About this train mission we're doing? No. No one knows? Um, alright. I'll tell you what. You stay here. I'm gonna go check it out on foot, okay? Keep an eye out. Victor, come in. Victor, we uh, we have a slight issue here. So, there is a, uh, a barricade. There's also a helicopter right next to us, but I believe that's friendly. I'm pretty sure I saw them in the safe zone not long ago. I'm not too sure what they're doing out here. We have a barricade on the tracks, and I'm not sure the train can get through that or not. What should we do? All right, the cargo you're delivering is very, very precious, so if it's imperative, it doesn't fall in the wrong hand, kill any that, anyone that stands in your way. Well, right? I don't see anyone, that's don't the thing. Don't ask questions, just kill them. And try to try to use the train speed to ram through the, the barricade. That ram it. through it? Okay, well, it's, it's, a, a, it's a truck in the way, and it looks like it's got it's got sandbags, it's got... Um... Oh, whoa, dude, dude! Alright, we're taking fire, we're taking fire. I gotta hang up. Jeez! Alright, Oscar, you good? They got a few hits on me then. Okay. Oh, this is not good. This is not good at all. Oh, I think I got a few shots on them. Oh, just keep up the heavy fire. Ah, Victor. This isn't good, man. We are being suppressed by a lot of outlaws right now. I don't know if we can actually drop off this train. Can you take them on? I don't know, man. There seems to be a lot of them, and they're just constantly firing right now. You know what? I'm going to try and take them out. Oh, I got a few shots on one there. All right, Oscar, Oscar, we're going to have to retreat. Oh, you good? I can see a lot of blood. You okay? Oh, the truck. Now's our chance. Now's our chance. Let's go. Go, go, go. Oscar, get in. Get in. Back up. We're going, we're going. Ram in the truck. No! Okay, we have to destroy that truck, man. Oscar. Open fire at the truck. We need to take it out. Come on. I don't know if it's doing damage or not. Oh, gotta reload. Oh, we got it, we got it! Okay, let's go. It still might be blocking the way, though. Let me get a run up. Oh, this has gone so wrong. How did the outlaws find out about this? There's someone in the bushes. Oh, it's not budging. It's not budging. All right, we're going to have to wait for it to just move. Right. We should be safe in the train. All right. All we got to do is sit here and wait for that truck to go. And then we can go on with the journey. We're literally in like a bulletproof okay. 
tank right now. I mean, it's a, it's a train. But it's pretty much a tank, all right? We should be fine. Just go wait for that truck to go. There's a naked dude over there. Victor. So, um... Little update on the situation here. Me and Oscar, we are currently sat inside the train. We have destroyed the barricade that was on the tracks. Uh, we're just currently waiting for it to go, and once it does, we should be at the location in no time. Um, so all is good, nothing to worry about. Wait. Thank you for the update. I was kind of getting worried there. Yeah, no worries, we should be fine. We got this under control. Oh, helicopter's right, returning. Where are they? There they are. All right, I'm gonna try and ram it one more time, but get more speed this time. They need to get out of here, those guys in the helicopter. They're gonna get shot by the outlaws. Okay, here we go, come on. No, it's just not budging. Ah, there's a lot of them. Oh no, they're shooting the helicopter. I knew this would happen, they need to get out of here. Those guys are not safe up there. Come on. Oh, one, no, I think one died. No, they got one. They're still suppressing, look at them go. In the helicopter up there. Right now, they are giving us some pretty good fire support right now. I mean, me and Oscar, we're sitting ducks in here, but... Well, actually, they can't get us, so we're good. Oh, it's gone! Alright, we're good to go. The helicopter's leaving as well. Yes, we are out of here. Look at this. They were ready for this. Oh! Oh, no. They have motorbikes. You know what? Doesn't matter. I'm on a train. This thing's a lot faster than their bikes. Oscar, we have three outlaws following us right now on dirt bikes. Um, there could be uh, a fight at the end of this. They're, gonna, they're just going to follow the tracks until we get to the end, so... This is not going to be good. Oh, here's the tunnel. It's so weird just driving backwards like this. It shouldn't be too far now. We've got a lot of distance on uh, the, uh, the outlaws, so... We should be alright. That was pretty intense, though. I still don't even know what's in the crates. I haven't even checked yet. I want to know what's inside. All right. How far now? We've got to be close. I can see the sea. I think that's our location there by the cranes. Look at this. Still haven't even explored some of the map yet. By this beep. I see a boat. Hello? Hey, it's us. Hold fire. Oh. Just slow it down. I'm going to bring it this way so we can actually uh, get onto the boat easier. Guys, get ready. Some outlaws are following us right now. Get ready for a fight. All right, all right. Weapons out. Oh, so this is what they got. Is this beans in a bowl? Seriously? That's what we're delivering? I'm going to take left side, okay, guys? Until they get here because they're going to follow the tracks until they find us. Um, I saw three outlaws on dirt bikes, okay? So the minute you see them, just open fire. Maybe if I hide in this little shack here whatever this is, and then wait for them. I might just be able to, like, ambush them. It's getting pretty dark now. Sun's going down, but we have delivered the stuff, so that's the important thing. We just need to take out these outlaws when they arrive. Should be able to hear them, right, on dirt bikes. Oh, I see him! I see him! Okay. Oh, they're coming my way. All right, come on. That's one down. Oh, needs to reload. Needs to reload. Oh, this is a good idea coming over here. Very good idea. Although, I don't see any anymore. Did we get him? Did we kill them all? Yeah. That was easy. Hey, good job, yeah. fellas. All right, secure the area. There could be more in the way. Take their loot. Oh, that's some good uh, stuff, too. Dressings. Yeah. I need that. Like, yes. I'm this one, guys. Ooh, some good stuff right here. Wait, they didn't lock their vehicles? Wow. No, they didn't. The outlaws have a lot to learn. Oh, this one's locked. All right, whoever was driving that one just forgot to lock it. I'm taking that grenade. Okay, let's uh, let's get all the cargo back in there. So this is the boat that uh, they're shipping it to. I don't really know much about where they're taking it to or anything like that. But I've done my part. I've delivered the goods here. This is what Victor wanted from me. So, yeah, I've done what needed to be done. Right, let's get all the uh, the cargo off. Are we good? Nothing left. You guys got it? Is there anything left? All right, listen up. Me and Oscar, we're going to head back now, okay? Oh, uh, what is that? What is that? I, I heard a vehicle, guys. Is that another outlaw? I definitely just heard a vehicle. Whoa! Whoa! Hey, what happened? Did you just find another one? I thought we killed them all. All right, we need to go. You guys headed off? Yeah, we're off. All right, good luck on your journey, okay? All right. All right, see you, man. All right, see you guys later. Victor, come in. Cargo complete. We've, uh, we've done it. We're heading back now, okay? 
Right, let's go. Right, just to know, I'll meet you back at the rendezvous point. All right. Yeah, the train is definitely faster when you go forward. Not by much, like I said earlier, but it is faster just by a bit. Hopefully, they have set up another barricade on the way back now. That would not be good at all. But it is a little bit worrying how the outlaws knew about what was going down today. Unless they always had that there. I don't know. They could have been waiting there for a long time, just hoping the train would go past. We're here, back in the barricade. Look at that. There's not really much to it, just a bunch of sandbags and some barricades and also that van, which I'm glad we destroyed. And we are back where we started. I think I can see some night vision goggles there. Yep. That's Victor, all right. We made it. Okay. There we go, Victor. Job done. I mean, I'd be lying Welcome if it was, uh, you know, if I said it was easy because we did run into some issues there with the outlaws, but uh, me and Oscar here, we managed to clear them up. You got me work there. I yeah, it was, was a close one. About that. You see, you did a fantastic job here today, and considering the troubles you had to go through, how about this as payment? The train? You're going to give me the train? Yes. But don't you need this for more yeah. cargo missions, like the one we just did? We, we most likely will. So I ask you not to, you know, build restaurants or hotel rooms on it <laughs> for the moment. Yeah, sure, man. <laughs> like, like we did in the past. A soprano, so you can have it. And wow. if we need it in the future, when we need it in the future, we'll just, you know, ask you to borrow it. I'm sure that won't be a problem. No, but no, But for the course. trouble you went through with the outlaws and all, I think you deserve it. Ooh. Get to keep the train. That's actually a pretty cool gift right there. So I know it's like really dark out right now, but uh, I'm going to end this video right here. Victor's going to give us a lift back to the safe zone, and then I'm going to get some rest. So I hope you all enjoyed this one. Remember to comment, like, and subscribe, and I shall see you in the next one. Goodbye.